I hope you all are doing great. Welcome back to our channel Agla Same Schools. Today in this video I will be covering chapter 2 of class 5th of environmental studies that is a snake charmer's story. So let's discuss question and answers. Now turn to page number 17. Think and tell. Here question number 1 says Have you ever seen anyone playing a bean and where? So the answer is yes. I have seen snake charmers playing a bean. I have seen them in a fair. Further question number 2 says have you ever seen a snake and where? So the answer is yes. I have seen a snake. I have seen it with the snake charmer and also in a paddy field. Now question number 3 says were you scared by it and why? So the answer is yes. I was scared by it. I have heard that snakes are poisonous now question number 4 says do you think all snakes are poisonous so the answer is no i don't think so for the question number 5 says in chapter 1 you read that snakes do not have ears which you can see can the snake hear the bean or does it dance when the beans move what do you think so the answer is snakes cannot hear the bean They dance when they move. Now turn to page number seventeen. Right, question number one says, "Have you ever seen animals being used for entertainment of people?" First, when and where did you see this? So the answer is, I saw animals being used for entertainment of people in a circus. Now second part is, which animal show did you see? So the answer is, the circus had lions. elephants dogs hippo and monkeys now question number 2 says how did people behave with the animals in the show so the answer is the behavior of most of the people was good towards the animals for the question number 3 says was anyone teasing the animals and how so the answer is nobody was teasing the animals but once in a zoo i have seen people throwing water bottles at a bear now Question number 4 says what kind of questions come to your mind after seeing the animal show so the answer is many questions come to my mind after seeing that animal show and some of them are first is it fair to exploit animals for our entertainment second how are those animals caught third how are those animals trained fourth Do circus people handle those animals with proper care? Fifth, it would have been better if all those animals are set free. Now imagine that you are an animal in a cage. Think how you would feel. Complete the following sentence. I am afraid when my dash. So the answer is I am afraid when my trainers beat me in case of a mistake. Second, I wish I dash. Answer is I wish I could enjoy my freedom. Third, I am sad when dash. So the answer is I am sad when I remember my friends in the jungle. Fourth, if I had a chance I would dash. Answer is if I had a chance I would run to the forest. Fifth, I do not like it at all when dash. Answer is I do not like it all when people tease me. Now turn to page number 12. Right here, question number one says, like snake charmers, which other animal depend on animals for their livelihood? Answer is apart from snake charmers, which other animals depend on animals for their livelihood are milkman, poultry farming, tonga wala, farmer, washerman, etc. Now turn to survey people who keep animals. First question says. Talk to some people in your neighborhood who keep one or more animal for their livelihood. For example, a horse for a tonga, hens for eggs, etc. Name the animal they keep. How many animals are there? Is there a separate place for the animals? Who looks after them? What do the animal eat? Do the animal ever fall ill? What does the keepers do then? Make some more questions and discuss. make a report on your project and read it out in the class so guys let us assume ramlal the mink 
the milkman he has five buffaloes and seven cows he has made a shed for these animals ramlal and his wife look after the animals these animals eat grass and other animals fodder sometimes the animal do fall ill ramlal takes them to a nearby hospital these cows and buffaloes are a source of income for ramlal he earns money by selling milk on the day after diwali ramlal decorates and worships his animal now let's discuss what we have learnt question number 1 says the government has made a law that no one can catch and keep snakes what do you think about this law give reason for your answer and write in your own words answer is animals are often kept in captivity they are used for entertaining people for example snake charmers use snakes and madaris use monkeys to entertain people since they earn livelihood from these animals so they take care of these animals but no animal would like to live as a slave everyone likes to enjoy freedom i think the government law preventing catching and keeping snake is a good law so guys here i have covered all the question of this chapter in this video i hope you like this video and if you have any query or any doubt related to any of the question discussed please put your query in the comment section below for more such ncert solutions keep watching and do not forget to subscribe our channel agla sen schools and do not forget to wear mask and take good care of your health